Well, TK, as we all know, is locked up, okay? Uh, he's allegedly, you know, done some things, and uh, he might be, have to serve life, right? Well, his, uh, this, I'm sorry, the victims of TK's alleged crime, they're, they're taking him to court. They want to get them. He, he had a huge hit, we all know, in 2017, the race. And uh, he dropped visuals and the thing went viral. I think it got like 140 million views on YouTube. Tons, millions of streams on every pl streaming platform. And, um, and he, you know, this is like a, the track where he was running from these charges that he's actually in jail for now. And uh, he made a ton of money off of this while on the run. Uh, well, the family of Ethan Walker and survivor Zachary Belote filed a lawsuit Thursday seeking a million dollars in damages. Uh, of course, you always inflate what you really want because they settle out. Um and the attorney said, uh, the principle behind the case is that people and corporations shouldn't profit from violent crimes against the innocent. Tamor McNair, or whatever, I, I'm sorry, I can't say it. Tamor McIntyre, okay, I think that's how you say it, became a threat to society, possibly with encouragement of others, in order to promote sales of his music. I want those sales to compensate his victims not to enrich a record company that supports a child thug. That's what he says. Well, he, I think he has to be proven guilty first. Now, you know, more more evidence is saying that he's guilty, but he hasn't been proven guilty yet. Uh, TK, uh, I guess he had to do with 88 Classic, locked up last year. The earnings from his music are reported around $236,000 and... Uh, it's in a trust. Uh, it's called the Spendthrift Trust. Never even heard of that. Uh, Tiggy's label and manager were named in the lawsuit Thursday, which read McIntyre was encouraged or manipulated by his manager and 88 class workers to commit crimes in order to... Yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> I don't know how far that's going to go. Now, going on the run and profiting from... So maybe they have a case, but encouraging it i don't know about that uh tay k um is now sitting in prison and this from this stems from a 2016 home invasion and he'll be tried as an adult so uh we'll have to see how this all turns out but uh they want they want a million bucks so i don't know we'll have to see what happens guys uh this is george tower with jt news hit that bell hit the subscribe button and if you want to run ads in the channel, storytimemedia at gmail.com. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Appreciate you guys. Um, you guys are amazing. And uh, work hard today. Do your best. I appreciate you guys. And thank you for tuning in to watch me. I'll check you guys later. Peace.